Hi, I'm Will Cristobal and I'm an emergency room nurse. A typical day in the ER is not really that typical because it's always, it's different. Everything's different every day. I mean, granted, you'll see similar scenarios, but each person's different. So you have the non-critical to the extreme critical. I mean, for example, I'll, I'll get a guy with, with a laceration. I will clean it up and the doctor will stitch it up. Nice. Or someone will come in with abdominal pain. I'll put an IV line in them, get their blood work, start IV fluids, and give them pain medication to get them comfortable. Or a guy will come in with complete cardiac arrest. The whole team is inside the, the resuscitation room and we're, we're pumping, we're pumping, we're pushing medications, uh, we're putting IV lines, and shocking the patient, seeing if we'll bring them back to life. Sometimes it's successful, sometimes it's not. Nursing school is really cool. Um, I actually enjoyed it a lot. It, at first, it's very nerve-wracking because you're interacting with patients, you're touching patients. I was one of the very few men in the in the classroom, but I mean, it was no problem. That's it. The perception in nursing is typical. You, you think a nurse is a female. When and there's 10% of the profession are males. I mean, there's times when I've actually come in, saw my patient, hi doctor, how are you? I'm like, no, I'm your nurse. And then when the female doctor comes in, it's kind of like, this is your doctor. I'm your nurse. So I mean, it's, it's just really interesting, like the dynamics with patients sometimes, and that I actually have to correct them. And they always go, hey, you never thought about going to medical school? I'm like, no. I, want to be, I wanted to be a nurse. I enjoy nursing. I enjoy being at the bedside and taking care of my patients. My career path after high school, I actually um, thought about doing physical therapy. I actually wanted to be in the health field. I didn't want to be a doctor because I knew it was going to take so much time. So I thought about physical therapy. So when I was in college, I ended up taking classes geared towards physical therapy and decided I, didn't, I don't really like this stuff. But I still wanted to stay in healthcare. After college, I ended up just trying to find odd jobs, things to do. I worked for health insurance. I worked for HR, just trying to fit my personality. At any rate, I thought that was boring. And so um, I'll, one day, my, my uncle, my wife's uncle, was like, why don't you do nursing? He was a nurse. And so I said, well, let me look into it. I volunteered at this hospital, observed the nurses and everything like that, and doctors, and decided this is actually a cool gig. I'll do this. And so I applied to nursing school, and luckily I got in. So, so, bend this, so it's going to bend out like this. We have, to, we, have to, we have to cock it up a little bit. There you go. When it's really, really busy, you may have a critical patient in one room, and then a person that's not so critical turn critical on you in the other room, and you're trying to balance everything out while at the same time your doctor wants you to, you know, discharge a patient in the other room. So at, at any given time, I can have four patients, but all four patients can want something all at the same time. You have to really like people, because you have to deal with a lot of personalities. If you enjoy interacting with people, uh, helping people, make people laugh, make people smile, I mean, this is, this is a great career for you. I mean, if you love math, if you love sciences, I mean, this is, this is a great career to get into, because you, you use a lot of that stuff. I mean, you have to, because you have to think about disease processes, and so you have to think about your anatomy and biology and how the cells work and whatnot. The advice I'd give for high school students, volunteer. Go to a local hospital and volunteer. It, it will give you a chance you know, to know whether or not you, you want to do this because you'll be in direct contact with nurses. You'll be in direct contact with patients. You'll be in direct contact with doctors. And so you get an overall chance uh, to see exactly what this is about.